What's up, everyone? Jasbro Gonzo here. Another episode of What's Next, your daily dose of common sense and facts. You come across a story like this, and you're hoping the person's okay. But at the same time, you laugh at the irony because of who this person is, or shall we say, who this person is married to. And yeah, you pretty much get the gist. Let's take a look. This comes out of Breitbart. Nancy Pelosi's husband, Paul Pelosi, arrested for DUI in Napa Valley. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's husband, Paul Pelosi, was reportedly arrested and booked over the holiday weekend in Napa County, California, after driving under the influence. Yes, because, as we all know, Nancy never takes a drink. The Speaker's husband was arrested just before midnight Saturday at Napa County and booked jail in the jail just hours later, just after 4 o'clock in the morning, on two counts, according to Napa County Criminal Justice Network. According to the arrest records, two misdemeanors were uh, he was arrested for unlawful for a person who's under the influence of any alcohol or beverage to drive a vehicle. Of course, it is unlawful for a person who has 0.08% or more by weight of alcohol in his or her blood to drive said vehicle. The exact details of the arrest have yet to be arrest, uh, released, as well as the mugshot of the person arrested, a Paul Pelosi. However, TMZ, of course, it's TMZ, also reported the description of the 82-year-old 82 aligns with his publicly known description, particularly his birthday, April 15th, 1940. The bail was set at $5,000, please. I mean, come on. The guy can pull that out of his uh, sock drawer. Paul Pelosi was released at 7.26 a.m., according to Napa County Criminal Justice Network. There has yet to be any official statement from the speaker herself or any of her children immediately um, from the family at this time. When speaker's office was asked for a comment by Breitbart, her spokesperson, Drew Hamill, said, The speaker will not be commenting on the private matter which has occurred while she is on the East Coast. Yes, because being in one part of the country has nothing to do with the situation that happened in the other part of the county, country. Okay. Nancy Pelosi's official tax funded office live streamed her commencement orientation 22 graduates. She also received an honorary doctorate degree. Why we have no an idea from Brown University. So, but uh, yeah. Nancy Pelosi, you have blazed a path for women in politics like few before you leading with the persuasive, determined, and relentless approach required to enact positive change. The first woman to be elected as Speaker of the House. You yeah, uh, you pretty much have seen enough. This also comes out of Breitbart. Nancy Pelosi's husband involved in a car crash before the DUI arrest. Yes, it wasn't bad enough that you were had 0 0.08 alcohol above, you know, in your blood, which, of course, that's a no-no. Yeah, let's just hit something before you're caught. Paul Pelosi, husband of House Speaker Nancy Pelosi, was involved in a two-vehicle car crash roughly an hour before his arrest for driving under the influence, according to California Highway Patrol. Pelosi was driving eastbound on Walnut Drive when he attempted to cross a state Route 29 in his 21 Porsche. Of course. Come on. What do you think? He's going to drive a Yugo? Was struck by a Jeep traveling northbound just before 10.30 p.m. Saturday. In a, in a CHP statement. Photos of the junkie reportedly show Pelosi would have had to driven through a stop sign to get on SR-29. Video of the crash reportedly shows a busted out fence and a downed stop sign. CHP determined that the crash uh, to be a two-vehicle non-injury crash and arrested Pelosi for driving under the influence at 11.44 p.m. Just five miles away from Pelosi's River Run Vineyard, law enforcement did not arrest the 48-year-old driver of the Jeep. It, you know, wasn't his fault. And of course, Nancy Pelosi has been silent on the entire affair. The unfounded rumor that Nancy Pelosi doesn't drink or has been drunk at times during her political career, of course, is unfounded. But those closest to her or those who have worked for her in the past, yeah, say otherwise so i'm kind of not surprised that the husband drinks as well you know not just because you own a vineyard or anything you know you're just in it for the money um but um for him to get involved 
for him to drink, drive, crash, arrested, charged, release on bond is not surprising to me. What is very surprising is that Nancy has never been caught by the cops drinking and driving as well. Not that we know of. But um, one, of course, glad he's okay. I'm glad the person who's driving the Jeep is okay. But at the same time, it is just funny and ironic that Nancy, who has been rumored for her drinking uh, episodes and her drinking prowess, of course, she I think she might have been caught on video one time with a wine glass in her hand. Not absolutely sure. I cannot confirm. But, um, of course, the husband uh, were hoping that this was just a first-time offense. And with that being said, I'm Jasper Gonzo. This is What's Next. Want to see more like this? Please leave a comment below. Like it. Share it. Subscribe to it. And, um, yeah. We'll catch you on the next one. Peace.